Hello ladies and gentlemen, tubers and groovers, and welcome to the special edition of Take the Fear Out of Gear with him, Chumley Warner. And him, Mr. Jason Bangers. What we got today, Si? We've got the Tokai Metal Driver. And I'm guessing, because I can see it, and there's a picture right on the screen, right in front for the folks, I'm guessing it's a guitar pedal size, if I don't already know. <laughs> it is a guitar pedal, yes. Well, just say, that's not dust, by the way. It's got, um, it's mirror flake, or it's metal flake, or whatever you want to call it. It's uh, metallic. Yeah, it's got white flecks or silver flecks in it. It's cool, isn't it? It feels like a boss pedal size. Really heavy. It really does feel well made. Tokai were good, weren't they? Yeah, Or are good. I don't know if they're still going. The way that... That, that mechanism on there is very unusual. I don't know if you can see that. I'll try and zoom in, but these these, these arms here move. Look. It's like a whole pivot, which is really unusual on a pedal. Normally, it's just this bit here that goes down. Have you noticed that? Yeah, it is it's really nicely made, that isn't it? Is, isn't it? I've never seen that before. Mm, high pitch I'll go when I'm excited. Well, it's a pedal. It's a guitar pedal. Let's just go. It's time for... <laughs> Jumbly stats. Well, I've got to say it. It's stat time it's again. Stat time again. Stat time again. So, what is Did this? Did you know someone said we was fat? Yeah. Well, I'm I'm I'm, I'm officially on my diet now. So. Yeah, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> we we can see what happens in a few months' time, and you can send some comments saying we, we're two fat jolly blokes. Do I look slimmer or not? No, yeah. I ain't losing weight. Stuff it. Yeah. So the Tokai Metal Driver. This is. 1980s made in japan metal pedal goodness mm. so, so what is it then it's like people have been saying it's like a tube screamer and you've got a sweepable mid on it uh which we can show you another picture the name suggests it's a heavy metal pedal i.e fuzz box type thing it's not no and it's got four controls on it it's got frequency brightness drive and level obviously your frequency is the sweepable mids they're talking about and it's useful for anything from metal to blues mm. it is awesome it on the front here you got the little like like the boss pedals you've got the little screw so you can just flip the lid put your battery in you can run it off nine volts and it is a piece of awesomeness well inside i think what we should do we should lay some music down some backing tracks and play some guitars so they can see what this thing sounds like yeah definitely here we are again tubes chumley and bangers are at it again so what what we've done um we just put some drums down, been out in the studio, recorded some drums, and then come in here and uh, put some bass guitar and some rhythm guitar down for you. And I'll show you what we've done. So starting with, uh, let's, let's mute that, let's mute that. So here's the drums, and this is Walking By Myself, Gary Moore. So nice and simple drums. Um, a bit of bass guitar. Don't know if you can hear that on this camera. And then rhythm guitar. I'll do this so you can hear the rhythm on its own. Okay, all done on this here pedal, going straight into reason, okay? And now what we're going to do now is play all that back to you and whack a solo on top of it. of uh, poo playing from yours truly sorry oh, that's the best I can do I thought it was very good I'm no Phil Hillborn and never will be nor will anyone else be alright Phil hope you're well mate hope you're well oh and Mr Frost we might as well say hello to you as well since you're out there hello Andy um, in your stats you didn't mention price so is it, is, it, what, is it a really expensive thing or what yeah it is is it no <laughs> not, as, not as expensive as a clon a clone clon or even a tube screamer no have a guess, dude. Oh, I've no idea. 50, 50 60 quid, I don't know. 80, I don't know. Yeah, you... Yeah, well, 100... Uh, well, I, normally, I suppose something like this would be about 139. That's what I've been looking at for 
bit bit crunch is it bit crunch um, tube screamers tube screamers tube screamers yeah. well you're, you're right on all those accounts we had a quick look earlier and prices seem to go from anywhere from 55 to about 120 second hand on the used market oh, well that, that was easy saying 50 60 70 80 90 to 139 but then here's a more difficult one go ahead. how much did i pay for it oh i've no idea knowing you probably 30 40 quid you jammy get 25. Ooh, snide. <laughs> Suit you, sir. Snake in the grass. <laughs> what a snake in the grass he is. Mr. Chumley Warner had a bargain. you got to keep your eyes open. you got to keep looking. Marketplace? Facebook Marketplace, yes. We love Facebook Marketplace. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed that. Something a little bit different from us here at Take the Fear Out of Gear. It's goodbye from me, Jason Bangers. And it's goodbye from me, Mr. Chumley Warner. Please hit the bell, slap like, and subscribe. We'll see you again soon. Take care, chips. Yo!